Good morning, everyone. My name is Avery Moore, and I'm a graduate assistant for student victim assistance at Georgia State University. Welcome back to another student victim assistance virtual coffee chat. Today, we're going to go ahead and talk about how you can help support a loved one who's struggling with anxiety. Let's chat about it. One of the first things you can do to help support someone with anxiety is understand what anxiety is and how it might be manifested. Additionally, always remember that everyone is different. Anxiety can be showcased through physical, mental, and behavioral symptoms. Physical symptoms may include lightheadedness, nausea, feeling restless, or experiencing sleep disruptions. Those experiencing anxiety may be persistently worried, believe that the worst may happen, or overgeneralize. As a result, they may seek reassurance, often second-guess their decisions, avoid certain activities, or become irritable or frustrated when anxious. Remember that although these are common symptoms, everyone has different experiences with anxiety and as a result may exhibit symptoms outside of these. In supporting someone with anxiety, one thing that might help you is to understand what to do and what not to do. Offer validation to your loved one and ask how you can support them when they're feeling anxious. If you notice your loved one has started to act differently and you think it might be anxiety, you can approach them in a warm, calm way and mention you've noticed some changes in their behavior recently and want to check in. Never force someone with anxiety to do something they don't want to do because you want to help them overcome their own fears. Everyone moves at their own pace, and those experiencing anxiety can be empowered by conquering their fears slowly with the help of a professional. Also, depending on your relationship, it is okay to ask someone how they would like to be supported and when they would like to work through things separately with a counselor. Seeing someone you love struggling with anxiety can be really hard, but recognizing you don't always have the skills to help is important. We all want to help, but it is important to remember that we don't have the skills to assist in the way a professional could. Your mental health is important too, so if you are supporting someone with anxiety, never feel bad about taking time for your own self-care and well-being. Thank you so much for tuning in to our virtual coffee chat today. I hope that y'all learned a little bit more about how you can help support a loved one with anxiety. Make sure to tune in next Tuesday at 10.30 a.m. for our next student victim assistance virtual coffee chat. Have a great day. If you are seeking counseling services, consider reaching out to Georgia State University's Counseling Center. Students on all campuses can make an appointment with the Counseling Center by calling 404-413-1640, which is a 24-7 hotline. Same-day consultations are available virtually. In-person and virtual ongoing appointments are available on the Atlanta, Clarkston, Decatur, Alpharetta, and Dunwoody campuses. Virtual appointments are available for all campuses. If you have questions about trauma, need any type of crisis intervention, or would like to set up an appointment with an advocate, please give us a call. Student Victim Assistance of Georgia State University offers crisis intervention, advocacy, and support for students. We can assist students in determining their options and provide information related to their experience, even if they have no idea what they need or what they intend to do, which is a normal response to trauma. Students who seek student victim assistance services are not obligated to pursue criminal or university charges. Students who would like more information or would like to schedule an appointment to speak with an advocate in student victim assistance can call 404-413-1965. Advocates are available to help students who have experienced any type of recent or past victimization, whether it occurred on or off campus. Student victim assistance can help students regain a sense of control over their traumatic experience so that they may resume their academic and personal pursuits. Student victim assistance can help students who know someone who has been victimized or would like to learn more about student victimizations.